Hey everybody, what's going on? Devin here, back with another video. Today we are showcasing Dark Hamon, which is awesome. I really like the design of it. Nothing really new, which is really unfortunate, but it's pretty cool. Hamon Darkness is awesome. Um, it's, a you know, the design is great. Um, that's really it, though. I mean, it doesn't show us anything new with moves and stuff. So maybe if the, you know, owner is watching, which he might be, Maybe make this when you update the game or something next time you update it. Maybe give it some more unique moves and stuff. That'd be pretty cool to see. But anyways, let's get on to the moveset. The first move is Sendo Chop. Uh, sorry if I'm pronouncing this wrong. You press Q and you hit them back. It actually does really good damage. The next move is Sunlight Yellow Overdrive. It actually is pretty good. You hold E. It basically is an insta-kill. I'm not going to kill him because for one, time stop. And secondly, then I lose him. Oh yeah, by the way, shout out to Deadpool AZ123. Sorry if I pronounced your name wrong. Um, he let me borrow this spec, so that's awesome. So thank you, by the way. The next move is Scarlet Overdrive. You press R. And that's, you know, it's a pretty good move, but it's not as good as the Sunlight Yellow Overdrive or anything like that. The next move is Zoom Punch. You press T and you hit them. It's basically like the extendo arm thing, which is, you know, the meme for Hamon, I guess. So <laughs> the final move is Hamonic Blade. You press F. It's a Luck Pluck Sword. You just hit them back, which I really like about it. The Luck Pluck Sword looks really good in this game. Anyway, since so that's all the moves, let's get on to the 1v1. Okay, so really quickly, uh, before the 1v1, I forgot to mention its passives. It has three passives. Passive A is Sunlit Blood, which lets it regain health. Passive B is Hamon User, so it does 25 more damage to uh, vampires. But Passive C is Hamon Weakness, so it does 25 less damage to Cars and Santana. Which, I don't really get that part, but whatever, I guess. Anyways, now we can get on to the one we want. So overall, it is a pretty cool spec. I The only thing really uh, cool about it, though, is the design. It's unique. But the moves aren't different. It really just is like a different color aspect. I hope if a uh, developer or the owner or an admin is watching or something, make some, add something into this. Give it some new moves or something. Give it a different passive. That would be pretty cool to see. Um, anyways, guys, if you did enjoy this video, feel free to leave a like and sub. Um, if you're new to the channel, maybe share it around with your friends. That would be really helpful. I'll see you guys next time. Peace. Oh!